Hi guys, this is the Omega Seamaster Professional 300M259980 Chronograph 42mm Auto. You can purchase this watch on our website watchvoltnyc.com. This model comes with a scratch resistant sapphire crystal, features a blue wave pattern dial, with a date window at the 3 o'clock position. In addition to its central hand and mini hands, there are three sub dials. At the 12 o'clock position, you can see the minute dial that goes up to 30 minutes. And the 6 o'clock position, you can see the hour sub dial that goes up to 12 hours and a second subdial which is located at the 9 o'clock position. The minute and hour subdial will only run when you're using the chronograph functions, while the second subdial will run with or without those functions. Let's take a look at the case back. The case back is stainless steel as well as the case and bracelet. Caliber for this is 1164. It's a self-winding chronograph with a chronometer movement with a rhodium plated finish. Power reserve is 4 to 4 hours. It comes with the diver's extensions clasp and two push triggers on each side. To unscrew the helium valve to sit clockwise seal it back up counterclockwise. There are two pushers on the right side. The top pusher is to start and stop. The bottom pusher is to reset. Let's try it out. Start. Stop. Reset. To unscrew the crown, push the crown to the left, twist the crown counterclockwise. Should pop right out. Once it pops out, we can wind the watch about 30 times. Pull the crown to the right to change the date. So we can activate the first position. To pop right out. Now twist the crown clockwise to change the date. Pull the crown to the right to change the time. You can rotate the crown clockwise or counterclockwise. To seal the crown, push it all the way to the left, twist the crown clockwise to seal. Now let's check out the bezel. You could always use this bezel as a timer. Alright guys, thank you for watching, please leave a like and subscribe, comment down below on what watch we should review next.